Hello YouTube friends and fans. Today we're going to show you part two, the modifications done to this bike carrying basket. Stick around. KZ Creations thanks you for watching. Please press the red subscribe button for more featured videos in the future. Now on with the show. So quick modification here was made. You should be able to see it there. I shortened up for the tires. If you haven't seen part one of this video, basically took bag chair poles and cut them to length and welded the rods on. This is what I cut off. So you can tell there's uh, probably took two inches off of these. Shortened up the tire holders. This one you should be able to really tell. So this plate here in the front, I added because the width of the rear tire on these electric bikes are that much bigger. And I didn't want them rubbing together as much as they could. The bikes have a fender on them. So we'll put one on here so you can see why we had to make this modification. Grab your bike. Grab a hold again and help me lift it up. See how it wants to ride right over that fender? That's no good. And it's a hassle to get up and down. Now it fits right underneath that fender. Got our fancy straps that are spring loaded. Just pull from quick tension. Done this many times now, no issues with falling off or anything of that such. This bike rack is currently made for to hold 27 inch tires each unit measures 23 inches to the top that these were made out of 48 inch rod I don't know if they get much bigger than that but that's a pretty good sized tire on a bicycle and because these are electric bikes and the handlebars want to hit you got to alternate them. See how nice that fits under there? So there you have it. There's my modifications. And because we all have electric bikes now, I think you saw the extension on the front. If not, I'll go back here. I'll take these off. I'll show it to you. All right. Alrighty, friends. Stick around. I'll show you a couple updates I've done on the inside. Show you a project I'm currently working on. Hopefully, it ain't gonna be too much. So I have to repair the ladder, and currently have top screws out here, but not the last third section. So I'm waiting on parts for that because. Didn't know what I needed until I took it apart. So stick around for that story. All right, let's go inside. Back here in the wardrobe section, turn some lights on. We added a nice little shelf in here. Kind of split the difference. We're going to put towels and blankets in there so they stack a little better. And then this little fancy creation. The uh, back of the mirror frame, which is just a thin piece of wood and come off. 
So we glued her back on. Should be good to undo today. I don't know how long that's going to hold up. And if you can see it, already wants to move. But it was worth a try. Alrighty friends, thanks for watching. Catch you on the next video. Hope you like, subscribe, and comment below. Reach out if you need some help. Thank you.